Добрый день, друзья! 44 градуса на улице, мы в Арабских Эмиратах. Что же может быть лучше, чем съемки нового выпуска по производству настоящего итальянского джелата? Мы приехали в Шаржу и сейчас будем снимать процесс приготовления вкуснейшего мороженого. Пойдем! Uh, for viewing your uh, ice cream factory, it's uh, uh, my uh, dream from childhood uh, to see how uh, uh, gelata is producing. You will come and uh, thank you for your coming. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so, um, first of all, let's start. Uh, tell me, please, uh, how you decide to to run this kind of business? Uh, first of all, I like uh, ice cream. This one, number one. Number two. Gelato is the Italian ice cream, and which is one of the best ice cream in the world. Agree. Yeah, the the way that they make the ice cream, the Italian way, is very good and very high quality also, because they use all natural materials, natural ingredients like fresh fruits. They use the fresh milk, so there is no artificials or colors or something like that in gelato. This is what makes the gelato different than other kinds of ice cream. Okay, I see. Uh, so uh, when did you start this uh, business? This business started in 2012. 2012, this factory had been established. Okay, and uh, before uh, it was some related business or what was your business before? How you decided to come especially to gelato business? No, trading. Uh, before it was general trading in food. Uh, field, but not uh, ice cream. Mm -hmm. We check the market here in UAE, and we see that we found that we can we can sell high quality of ice cream in Dubai and Abu Dhabi also, because uh, there is a lot of high level places here, and they need high quality of ice cream. So uh, you're focusing on selling to uh, end retail or uh, wholesale to restaurants, to uh, shops, supermarkets. So what is your target? What is your target in most? Okay. Uh, my target was divided in two stages. Mm -hmm. Stage number one, supplier. We supply the hotels, we supply the restaurants, the coffee shop, the ice cream shops. This is our first stage for us. Inshallah, next stage will be we we plan to open our own retails or our uh -huh, own okay. outlets here because we want to our brand to be spread and to be known in the UAE market. I believe it's a local brand. It's not a franchise, so you, cre you yeah, create yeah, it from the yeah, scratch. Yeah. It's a local brand, but it's a Italian brand. Local, but the name or the, the the concept is Italian, but it's local brand. It's okay. not a franchise. Okay, understand. So you created here in UAE. That's great. Uh, just uh, our channel is uh, not about uh, food only. It's about business as well. So um, I definitely know that my subscribers would ask you. Uh, so roughly, what was the budget, or what is the budget, if someone wants to open the ice cream factory? So how much you should invest to open such? Uh, a business. This is uh, there is no specific number. I can tell you. It depends on how the the volume of the the business that you want to open, uh, how how much the capacity that you want to reach. But because gelato machines are very expensive. Roughly, how much? Yeah. Cost if you want, uh, I can I can mention a brand or no the machines. I can mention it. It's no. up to you. Okay. They know, don't pay us, so uh, okay. you can mention you can. Okay, <laughs> uh, gelato machines. Uh, if you want to buy the brand, which is named Carbigiani, it's very expensive machines, and you need at least to open production. At least you need two batch freezer, which is the main machine that make the gelato. Plus, you need a shock freezer, you need pasteurizing, 
and you need to make a freezer for storing. This is the basics for the gelato. And also you need a van or a vehicle for delivery. With, uh, with the freezer? freezer yeah, of course, it will be freezer here. So this is the essential or the basic materials or uh, things that you need to establish the business. Otherwise, offices like uh, furniture, this is extra. extra yeah. yeah. So minimum, how much? I don't think you less than let's say six hundred thousand like this. Dollars? No, no, no. Uh, UAE dirham. Dirham. Yeah. So one eighty dollars, one eighty thousand dollars. Yeah, approximately. You can say two two hundred. It's, you can in, say it's including first uh, first the first batch yeah, in, yeah. with ingredients. Yes. Or additionally, you need to buy ingredients. No, no. Stuff. This is just establishment. Mm -hmm. This is establishment and the machines. Plus ingredients. To start ingredients, the produ production, you, you need the ingredients. Yeah, right? of course. Ingredients you will buy later, step by step. You don't have to bring a lot of ingredients. Ingredients you will buy as what you make. Mm -hmm. You will not buy one ingredient, all the ingredients one time. You understand? But the ingredients, it's available in the market, by the way. Many brands here. Many companies in UAE selling the ingredients for the gelato. Mm -hmm. And all are Italian brands. Okay, I see, I see. So basically we can say that to open a small ice cream factory uh, you will need at least $200,000 including some production ingredients for the first stage. Yeah, yeah we can say that. Plus you, there is something, maybe you need some money, expenses for uh, approve, approve Approvement for from municipality from the, yeah yeah the bear machine is also to make also when you want to make test lab test for your your product also this is some expensive you need you need visa for your stuff yes definitely so it will be all additional cost yeah. okay I see uh, so basically I'm waiting for the moment when you will invite me to see the factory okay. We will come, we can go and now and we will see how they make the gelato. Yes. Guys, stay with us. Uh, hit like. Don't forget to comment what is your favorite ice cream. And we are going to the factory stage. We go now to the production area. This is the warehouse. This is the kitchen where we make the gelato. You can use this sanitizer. Okay. Yalla, bismillah. This is the first stage of the making the gelato. Here's the materials that we need. Here's the preparation room. We prepare here the everything, the materials, everything, and we go inside to the production. This is the main production area. Here we prepare the gelato. I will start with the first stage. Here is the first step of making the gelato. We call it the posterization process. We use posterizer, which we add inside the basic ingredients of the gelato including the milk and the stabilizers and the sugar and we, keep, we cook it here this posterizer machine it will heat the ingredients till 85 degree then start cooling till reach again 4 degree this time after finish this the base is ready with this we call it the base of the gelato base of the gelato after the posterization process finish we take the base take it and we take it here now it depends on the flavor that we want to make now what you want to make now, uh, Bernard? Now, now we want to make the caramel, gelato caramel base. Now this is 
the taste of the caramel. And as you see, it's Italian brand and Italian ingredients. It's normal based. Now he's mixing the base, the flavor, with the base that we take it from the moisturizer. Now the mix is ready to put in the freezer. Now we take this mix and put in the batch freezer. This is the gelato machine that makes the gelato. Now this machine is making vanilla flavor, it's already running, so we'll use now the second machine to make the, the caramel. The, the two machines, the same procedure, the same function, just this is a new model and this is little old model. So now this he made before the vanilla flavor, now it's ready to put in the tub. To fill it in the top. Now this is the fresh gelato. And by the way, gelato when it's a fresh, it's have special taste. Can I okay. It's just amazing. that make the gelato with a classic old machine uh, way. So before they make the gelato in the shop, they make uh, gelato in front of the people and directly they serve the gelato and give it to the people. Now we are going to the chiller and the freezer. Here we keep the material that we use. The materials have to be temperature between 4 to 6 degree. This is kind of the material that we use. Uh, example, this is strawberry. This strawberry based. This is the strawberry based. 
So this is like a gem, right? Yeah, but this is not the only gradient. I will tell you now how which each flavor we use. We have to use the base, this one, plus the natural one together. Ah, okay. What is this? This is dextrose. Dextrose is uh, it's a kind of sugar, but give less sugar uh, sweetness than the normal sugar, the white sugar. Ah, but it's necessary. To yeah, necessary, sugar. of course. Okay. And this is are the base that we use the flavors. This is. Uh, vanilla Caribe. Okay, I have a question. Yeah, uh, What is the difference between this and this flavor? Uh, this is another brand. Yeah, ah, this, just brand. Yeah, yeah, that's the brand. This is uh, vanilla, and this is I will. Say. After we make the gelato, we finish it, we keep it here, waiting for delivery. This is the kind of the fruit that we use. It's natural frozen fruit. We bought it from Poland. As you can see, it's 100% uh, natural, no, no added things. What is this? This is we put to the base with the milk. Now this, you want to open this chocolate? This is the chocolate that we make. It's Belgium chocolate. You can try. Dark chocolate. Nice. Uh, what is this down? Like this one, you can use one. Like this one? Yeah. Yeah, this is the... Vanilla, because vanilla is the most selling flavor, so we keep big stock for it. Okay, and this one? This is the this is the base, the base of the gelato. Is this in other words, you can see the stabilizer that we mix with the milk at the beginning. This will give the gelato the texture and the, to, to be uh, more creamy and uh, elastic. And this, this is for flavors, right? Yeah, and this is all for flavors. This is melon. This is. Uh, uh, strawberry, this is uh, chocolate, this is coconut. How many flavors do you have now? We make now about 50, 50 flavors. And what is uh, mostly unusual flavor which I cannot buy in uh, yeah. any shop? We make the dates gelato. Gelato with dates. You know dates is the Arabic flavor. So we make gelato, uh, we make the dates ice cream by the gelato wheel. It's very nice. What else? We make rose water also. Wow. We make, yeah, Mystica. This is, uh, let's say, not well known flavor to most of the people. Okay, hope we will try today something. Inshallah, inshallah, sure. Oh, ну как вам, друзья? Как мороженое? Вы когда-нибудь были на фабриках? Если были, пишите, расскажите свои впечатления, свои истории. А я хочу вам дать несколько фактов. Вы когда-нибудь задумывались о тем, в чем разница между обычным мороженым и джелато? Считается, вот, например, по американским стандартам, что мороженое – это субстанция, которая должна состоять из минимум 10% молочного жира. Также при замешивании, как вы понимаете, попадает в воздух. Так вот, мороженое американское должно составлять минимум 50% воздуха внутри. Это позволяет приобрести ему такой вот воздушный нежный вкус. Но напротив, итальянское джелато использует жирность молока максимум 3.8%. Но при замешивании они используют меньше скорости и меньше оборотов. Соответственно, попадание воздуха в процентном соотношении тоже менее 50%. Фишка в том, что мороженое и джелато отличаются еще тем, что мороженое тает намного быстрее, джелато, субстанция холодная остается намного дольше. 
и вкус э, э, джелата, он более плотнее, более насыщеннее. Вот, в принципе, такая минутка информативная для вас. Теперь вы знаете, чем отличается обычное мороженое от джелата. Now we have this some of our flavors that we make. We make more than 50 flavors according to the client's requirements. But this is the most selling flavors that we have. We have here coconut, mixed berry sorbet, uh, strawberry, uh, vanilla bourbon, uh, mango. mango sorbet, and uh, lotus biscuit, and chocolate. chocolate, and this last one, and uh, pistachio. Okay, what is this? This is a special product, or it's, you can say a special signature for our factory. We call it, they call it in Italy tartufo. Okay. This make of gelato, it's like a dome. He make a decoration already with it. It's mix of two flavors. This is hazelnut and chocolate, and inside uh, chocolate syrup. Oh, okay. Yeah. But he he cut it to you now to like this shape. But it's originally it's a dome. Okay. Yes. Uh, Ahmed, tell me please um, how long. It takes to produce the ice cream from the beginning up to the end in the cup. Okay. Uh, first of all, you have to prepare the base for most of the flavors. The, the milk base for most of the flavors. Mm -hmm. This base, according to the machine, it needs to heat and cold again. So it takes about two hours, this machine. After, the big amount of the base is ready. You can take it and mix it with the flavor and put it in the batch freezer. The batch freezer, as you say, as you saw, sorry, it takes only six minutes to finish the ice cream after mm -hmm. you mix it. Okay, I see. So with, with the ready base, if you have ready base, which you can prepare uh, before one day, you can make in six minutes or seven minutes, you can make 10 liters of gelato ready very quickly. Okay, fair enough. I think uh, this is the best time to try. I will start with this. It's already started melting. Mm. Wow. It's uh, really like, uh, you know, this uh, chocolate truffles. So it's the same idea, yes, but with the uh, ice cream. Was the time to open all? We'll try a few fast. I want to try uh, sorbet first. Mm. It's so intense. I mean, you 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 can feel. Mm. And this made guys. You saw che uh, cherry and berries yeah, inside, free uh, freezed one. Uh, where do they come from? Yeah. From Poland. They come directly and uh, they mix with the ice cream inside. This one. Wow, it's vanilla. Yeah? Oh no, it's coconut, wow. It's a very nice texture with uh, Pieces, small, small, small yeah. pieces, yeah. Mm -hmm. This is bourbon, vanilla bourbon. But is it allowed? Bourbon is whiskey. Is it allowed to sell? Yeah, the name is bourbon vanilla. But it's without alcohol. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> nice. And uh, even the flavor, you know, you, sometimes you take the ice cream, I mean, there is no flavor, uh, you cannot feel it, but here even it's frozen, but I can feel the flavor. This one is Lotus. It's very popular here. The Lotus, it's uh, cookies, guys who doesn't know, this is a cookies, uh, Lotus cookies, and they're mixing uh, with, with the cinnamon, yeah. 
It's very popular in uh, Middle East. Mm. Dark, intense chocolate. Very nice. And finishing with pistache. Wow. Okay, I'll tell you, my favorite will be berry, for sure, and uh, chocolate. This is two my my winners. Yeah, mango, mango, good as well. No, but actually, I'm sure all your 50 flavors are amazing, and uh, all all is superb. To, tell me, please, uh, who who are your clients? Now we are the Dubai support. We supply sorry the some of the hotels in Dubai and Abu Dhabi, some of the chain of brand coffee shop also in Dubai, and the small shop of ice cream also. Uh, what is more loud name of your client? What whom you are proud of? We have uh, few brand, uh, few hotels of Rotana mm -hmm. in Abu Dhabi. Uh, we have uh, Jebel Ali Hotels and Resorts in Dubai. Oh, nice. He is uh, our customer. And we have uh, Dynamic Hospitality, which is a hospitality company. Have under her umbrella some of brands of uh, coffee shop and restaurants in Dubai. Wow, very nice. Uh, guys, uh, we will uh, make a link down. So who wants to collaborate uh, uh, with uh, uh, Ahmed, uh, with uh, his uh, La Perla Nero company, La Perla Nera company. Uh, you can uh, um, apply to the link uh, and uh, find the contacts uh, and uh, make a partnership. Let's make a special offer for uh, for the clients uh, who will uh, who will apply. So what what it can be? Some discount or you give uh, you something really extra? Give, uh, I just Okay, especially for uh, Eat Beans clients, big discount uh, for uh, par a partnership with uh, ice cream La Perla Nera. Guys, I hope you like this episode. Hit like for Ahmad for this beautiful ice cream factory. Comment what is your favorite uh, uh, flavor, what would you like to taste. Uh, and guys, maybe we'll prepare especially for you so you can find in uh, Dubai and Abu Dhabi uh, places. And thank you for watching uh, our channel. See you next week. Thank you. Bye.